Welcome you guys. In this video, we're going to be doing four leg exercises and finishing up with the MMA bag. The first exercise you will see will be goblet squats. I did three sets using a 20 pound kettlebell with 15 reps each. Goblet squats or any type of leg workout takes breath control and it takes good form and plenty of water. As you see in this exercise, I am extremely focused on my breath and my form because when you're focused on form, you will not injure yourself. Um, after this first set, I did two additional sets at 15 reps a piece. As you see, there's a little bit of struggle there because I'm getting close to the 15th, um, the 15th rep. The second exercise you're going to see will be the KB swings. And again, this takes breath control and form. As you see, you're going, you're lifting the kettlebell not exactly above the head, but you're ending the kettlebell at the max height of the shoulder. So make sure that when you're doing this kettlebell swing, that one, you have a good tight grip, two, you exercise breath control, and three, you make sure that the kettlebell is not going over your head. So control that swing. As you can see in the video, it does take a lot of endurance and it does take a lot of breath control. Don't forget to drink plenty of fluids as you're exercising. It helps with muscles and it helps with, um, you know, just keeping you hydrated. You see, I had to take a few minutes to gather my breath and my thoughts together. And then I was able to continue on with the second set. So at this, in this part of the video, I did do two sets. In the first part of the video, I only showed you one, but I continued on with the second set for this part of the um, video. The last time I did KB swings, y'all, I literally had to use my inhaler. Tonight, not as much because I've been doing a lot of treadmill and cardio, so I've had a lot of chances to work on breath control. Now this third exercise is sumo squats. You see that my legs and my feet are pointing outward. So that's a stance that is working on the inner thigh muscles. And you also want to make sure that you have your form correct. And you're going as deep as you possibly can. Um, that formates a good squat. Still using a 20-pound kettlebell with these exercises. So... You know, it's heavy, but it gets the job done. Sumo squats get a little tiresome too. So you want to make sure that you do have your water on hand and that you complete each rep um, to the best of your ability. Do not slack on form. Do not slack on reps. After that, I did two additional sets because tonight was three sets of 15. So right now, to end the exercises, we're doing our side leg lifts. And I did three sets of 15. I have my light band on around my legs up at the thigh area because I couldn't find my medium band. Don't judge me. So I use my um, light band for this exercise and um, it starts to hurt after a while. Um, for some reason down towards my calf muscles it starts to hurt. But I make sure I don't work the same leg Three sets in a row, I switch sides, and then I go, um, after that set, I go back to the opposite leg. 
So you're going to see these long pauses and that's me trying to not be in pain. <laughs> but three sets of these guys and um, that will conclude the work, that portion of the workout, the legs. After that, I will do um, about five rounds, three minutes a round on my MMA bag. And that's just throwing punches and movement. My leg bent a little bit there because y'all, I was in excruciating pain. So I was just finding any way possible just to stop the pain and keep moving. Um, if you have any suggestions on how to properly do these without being in excruciating pain, which I, you probably won't, then, you know, send me a little message here. But after that, I do two more sets. And that will conclude the workout. If you have any pointers or if you have any questions, please message me and I will try to answer to the best of my ability. But thank you for watching and thank you for joining me on this journey as I continue to um, live healthy, work out, and try to stay fit.